Hello, I'm Fantastic and Fantastic, and today I'm going to be playing through the Alt UN5 of my Toy Dragon. Wait, I need to make combos. Not many, but some combos. Oh, I could play this. I could just see what comes down. Oh well. Interesting, Jake. And I guess it just is enough damage, isn't it? Plus all the light and the light things I need. Okay, I need a hard orb here. Okay, 100% shield now. Can't die, so makes it a little less stressful. Follow-up attack here, if I'm gonna go a little faster. Oh. It's more than enough to kill it. I didn't touch Erica, so it's gonna be Oh well. So the nice mass attack. Things should be fine. It is just the wrong color, eh? Oh, that's true, Jake. I also forgot the light thing as well. Because the light things are all pretty big.
I like large numbers. Okay, I dance for a couple of turns. That's a follow- four hard is a follow-up attack. That looked kind of weird to me. Makes sense, but it still looks weird. You know, they just keep dancing, right? This back on ladies and gentlemen. Charge him up. Okay, I can try and kill now. Okay, it's dead. We're looking good. And hello, Break Car, welcome back to the stream. How are you doing today? Alright, we are going to Toy Dragon with the sub only. And then my leaders, even if they get delayed, it won't be delayed enough, and I'll be fine. This noise hurts my soul. Nice thing about high combo counters is your healing becomes quite significant. Okay, we use our leaders and we're fine. I should really start popping this one so a bit later on. To a certain extent, yeah, Sword Evil, it's pretty magical. Plus, it actually increases their real attack, like their leader skill multiplier also goes up. Poison orbs, actually. Oh my goodness! Thank goodness. I thought I was gonna die. Because the poison sky fell. That would have been pretty horrifying. I don't like this guy. Let's 
So I need my assist with L's of light and red. seconds to move lord which is a little silly. So I'm gonna match lots of red, green, and blue combos because they give the most Focus on the colors that I care about. To make sure I hit at least 10, to then give myself the shield for the next floor. So I didn't make an L, unfortunately. But I'm not dead, so this is good. Thank goodness, we're back to our regularly scheduled programming. It has resolved. We are going to make a real follow up attack. Not one of those fake ones. I miss having my shield. I hope I don't need it on the next floor. Thank goodness I am combolicious. Dirty one, it does matter. Because all the orbs can be negative. So even if you change, like, say, red to blue, if that red orb was negative to begin with, even if you have blue OEs, it doesn't matter. So you actually need all the colors. Alrighty, I need to make a real follow up attack, ladies and gentlemen. Quite confident it's dead. Like, you hear the noise, it's extremely high pitch. Yes, Sword Evil's correct. That's the reason why. Okay. I can't deal with a blue absorb, so I have to. I really need to shield myself. Thank goodness I have a real follow-up attack available. Wait, oh, I didn't use Erica. Okay, we got the follow up attack, we got the absorption, we're looking good. I should make a cross though for sure. So because I have enough orbs, I'm just gonna make a cross. 
and not have to worry because I will actually take advantage of the fact that there are two turns. So cross, cross, no more sticky blocks. We're good. Should have maybe made a party match. Oh well. We gotta go, go, go. as well. But although damage not really necessary on this team, I think about it. She absorbs green and light, and probably has too much health. So this is a problem. Because Erica's four turns away, and this is an awkward amount. It's asking a lot for sure, dirty one. Nay has so much HP. I can't follow the attack because green, like my blue, blue versus green has no way of punching through. There's no way I can punch through with just blue, considering my last attributes are yellow, which will heal it up all the way, and green. So instead, I will make better healing choices. So now, oh. So now here's my problem, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if I'm going to do enough damage or not. Also, the wrong toy dragon's buffed. So I don't think it's possible for me to kill it because the wrong toy dragon is the one who's buffed. You know what? We're here anyways, so we'll just go smacking. I guess I could have maybe not matched the light orbs, maybe. So I'm pretty sure I can't do it now. Yeah, I was ready. So now that this is the last toy dragon, maybe this kills it, or maybe I execute myself. We'll find out together. Because there's nothing I can do, there's no such thing as damage control. There's just damage and pain. Maybe I shouldn't have matched the light orbs, I guess. But then again, what am I talking about? I I'm pretty sure light would fall down. Nope, I just physically... Oh yeah, because even if the green attribute does... The green attribute does more damage, so it's impossible for me to kill it at this point. I just have to keep dancing. It's actually just impossible now to kill it at this particular moment. So I might as well just keep, you know, staying alive. One more turn for Erica. I was like, I could maybe not match Light Orbs, but then what if it ends up being bad? Oh, I killed it. How? You know what? We don't question things. It didn't execute me, so we don't question it. So there is no reason not to use Erica at this point. 
Everything has a real result. Wow, that is not a good number of hard orbs. Dark combo is not going to change my life. I still mashed it at the end anyway. So I'm going to lose one turn of my shield here, which is kind of rude. Are also a real resolve. So remember, Leona is just used to RCD buff myself basically on the next floor. Oh, wait, my shield made time perfectly. I can put it back up again. But I need to heal myself. Woo, not dead. So, this is a fake resolve in the sense that I could just match heart four heart orbs and not die is my priority. And with the Leona RCD buff, it makes this a bit easier to heal. I do also have a shield going into the next floor, which is nice. But it won't kill me. It's fake. And I'll just make sure I heal again. Same idea. And I got very few hard orbs last time. I just don't get hard orbs. This is actually almost alarming. I should be able to heal enough to take the gigantic monstrous hit on the next floor. Hoping I do, but I believe in the big combo count. I also have a shield, which means I should live, because the time I died is because my shield was down because of the stupid on-death animations. Dead. Big shield is big. Yeah, just not many hard orbs, eh? Oh, barbers are actually extra painful now. Oh, I'm not dead, thank goodness. Okay. I just missed a color. It has a real resolve too, so that actually alarms me. Wait, does it execute me with resolve? I don't know. We're just not going to take a chance because trial and error is not fun. Oh, 
Oh, you're just a meaty meat stick. Okay, we'll just keep doing this again. Greatly reduced, that's not a good sign. Guard break across like every card because of assists or just natural awakening, so we look good. So my shield times perfectly that I can attack buff myself, which is nice. One moment, I'm just recording. In like 10 minutes. Okay. Oh my screen! No! This is not- This team can clearly win. Not now! I just can't. This is- This is gonna win. I don't see how this won't. Skyfall? Well, this is disheartening. Plenty of time left over. The team obviously works. You can just imagine that I just make- Combos on 7x6 and I won. That's kind of what it's going to look like, I feel. Okay, then. Alrighty. So, with that being said, hopefully all you lovely ladies and gentlemen out there in the audience have a truly fantastic day. I wish you best looking at your own pet adventures. I'll just put this onto YouTube because this is not fun to keep trying over and over again. And happy puzzling. Maybe I should get a new device.